Okay, so we had a fun time at the Tallgrass Prairies earlier, and now we are walking through a cool light display at Rima Bible College. So they did a whole outdoor walkthrough display, so it's we're... It's freezing outside. It's a little oh, cool. freezing. It's 50 degrees out. Here we are at Arbuckle Wilderness Park. We saw this on the side of the road, so we decided we'd try it out. Here we go, we're gonna see what it's like to feed some animals at this park, I guess. Here we go. Hey guys, so we had a super fun time at the Arbuckle Wilderness Park. Um, the animals were pretty cool. We liked seeing them. My favorite was the zebra. What was your favorite, Brielle? Zebra. We got your... to pet it. Its nose felt like a horse. <laughs> the donkeys. The do they were so cute. They were so tiny. There was, however, a casualty because of that. Um, the, yeah, the zebra uh, was putting his head into Mike's window, and I'll insert a picture of that here. And Mike thought it was gonna bite his leg, so he kind of jumped and made the zebra jump, and it knocked off the window. I mean, the mirror off the off the window. The yeah, driver yeah. side when uh, the driver side mirror. I'll show you that here. So that made this a little bit more of an expensive um, trip. trip, but yeah, but uh, it was still fun. I'm yeah, it was fun. We had a good time anyway. Speedway. 
we've been driving for a while now. We left at 8.30 this morning. The Arbuckle Wilderness Park kind of put us... An hour and a half, maybe? An hour and a half, yeah, about an hour and a half there. But then, because of the window, because of the mirror... We did, it did not knock out our window. Thank goodness, that would be horrible. But because of the mirror, Mike had to hold the mirror while we were driving for a little while because he was afraid it was going to fly off out the window. So we did that for about 20 miles until we made it to a, a, a car store where he cut the mirror off with the guy who works there. So now we're driving home without a side view mirror, which Mike says is okay, but it's certainly not when it ideal. Gets dark out. Yeah, when it gets dark out, that'll probably be a problem. But right now he's just kind of, you know, figuring it out. Um, so the GPS is saying that we should get there around six o'clock, but I don't know if I believe that be because we've been um, stopping. I don't. I don't even know if we've gone since we've gone to every city. Waco. Well, we've got, oh, well, no, Waco. Uh, after we got through stop. Fort Worth. Fort Worth. After we got through Fort Worth, I don't even think we went 30 minutes driving Dallas, too, was, without so hitting traffic, right? Yeah. So we keep getting off the highway. It's just so much traffic. So, um, ton of accidents too. Oh yeah, tons of accidents. Overturned cars, cars going the wrong way on the highway. I don't know, we've probably seen about four or five just in this trip now. You can see them on the GPS. It was a really great trip. We loved our trip to Oklahoma. It was fun. Um, this trip home is not so great right now, but it, I'm glad we went. It was worth it. It was a really good time. You have a good time, Brielle? Yeah. Good, good. All right, so that's it. Bye.